I believe in you guys. I still have faith in you though, Uncle Mel. My feet are not used to the rubber boots. They're not used to the boots? No, because they, my feet move around too much. I don't know if you can see behind me, but we did our first layer of rocks towards the back. So our project to repurpose all of those rocks that we found in the back of the property is working out effectively. We have used the rocks towards the creek and it's coming along quite nice. We did the dam, we actually improved it a little bit and then did a barrier for the water to flow out of the property without taking any soil with it. So let me give you a close up and then we'll talk to dad about our little project. You see, as I was saying, here are the rocks that we used. We got them out of the ground. Some of them were on top of the surface after we did our excavation work. And instead of trying to figure out how to take them out of the property and getting rid of them, we just decided to use them here on site. And this is what it looks like. So this is kind of like our version of a dry creek bed. These were a lot of rocks and we got quite a bit more to put in but this is just the beginning phase of what we're doing so as we continue to till to plow to plant and do our agricultural expansion we'll have rocks added to this area let's go check on dad and see i think he has his wheelbarrow with some more rocks to add let's go check on dad Dad, can you explain what you're doing right now? Well, what we're doing, we're slowing up the run of the flow of the water. You know, uh, that's basically what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what we decided to also do, I showed you the uh, outside of the fence where the creek is located, how we did our, tr our dry creek bed, but now we're adding what we call beaver dams along the way. A little bit more rocks to kind of like slow the flow of the water as it transitions through the through the property because what we're encountering when there's a good rain it causes damage to the fence in the front so our objective is to build tiny little beaver dams along the way just to have the water slow down through the property and we're using our hands doing it manually using a hand tool and we're using that along with the handy dandy metal wheelbarrow so that's what we're doing you got another one down there already let me see how far back did you go dad You started right here. Just slow it up a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. 
That way we have continuous water. Let me show you. It's span in there. Let me zoom in so that we have continuous water coming through and kind of just to slow the progression of the water as it goes through the property. So this is what we're working on and it's coming along. So this is our update on the creek and on the dry creek bed and the rocks that we found in the property. And also I'll give you a close closer look at the dam so you can see how the dam now looks. So hold on for one second. This is a closer look at the dam that we created and a closer look at the channel. You see, we have slowed the water going towards the road. So the channel was actually widened a little bit so that the water could go a lot smoother through the property. So this is our update on the dam that we built and the rocks that we added in order to help with water management and erosion control. And we also added some shrubbery to the front. So it actually doesn't look bad. need to clean it up a little bit but this is how the creek now looks after we added rocks and some vegetation to help with the amount of water that's on the property hey 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 how y'all doing you finally uh finished upgrading the dam we took the the rocks off the back of the property and we brought them up here and you can see what we done did and so this would be a, a good rainy rainy day and we'll see the beauty of the water coming through the screen you know so this is the whole view the outside of the fence the inside of the fence all the way to the dam so we finally finished it how long did this take dad to update it oh my god three good days three good days yeah three good days three yeah. good dry days yeah three good dry days Step back a little bit quickly. So they can get a good view? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you see that, watch out for the wheelbarrow. You can see that wheel you come along pretty good. Yeah. So the repurposing of our rocks, we repurposed them for the creek yep. and the dam. Just need to wait on the rain. So this is our damn update. Okay, remember to like, share, and subscribe to Tiffany Phone. We really appreciate it. Thank you.